Hey guys, David L.A. Sleeve. We have before you here a demo block that Don at Elevate asked us to put together for him. This demo block is going to give you a visual illustration, a perfect illustration of what we can do for a Volvo motor. We've got a closed deck design, as you can see here. We've got an open deck design, as you can see here. And of course, we've got the stock hole to give you an idea of what we're trying to eliminate and what we're trying to produce. When we design sleeves for given applications, we try to provide a sleeve for the end user or the end of the project, a sleeve that's going to give them what they need. If you look at this demo block for the Volvo, we created a closed deck sleeve, which you see in front of the block, an open deck sleeve, and here's a stock cylinder here. The closed deck, we, we recommend for drag racing, although street racing is okay, or street use. The closed deck gives you a little bit more girth in the top of the block, which allows for greater turbo, or if you're gonna spray the motor with nitrous, it gives just an added defense based on the girth of the sleeve for the deck of the block. When we pull the sleeves out, you can see we've cut away the stock aluminum and the stock sleeve and we're straight into the aluminum there. The sleeves are going to have more girth than a stock, out, uh, stock Volvo block's ever going to give you. So for drag racing, a block like this with this style of sleeve, frankly you can get up to about 1800 horsepower if you really want to hammer it with nitrous. The sleeves go in quite easily. It's a slight press fit, they sort of drop down into place. You'll notice in the top of the sleeves we cut a channel and you'll see this channel here in this example. The reason for the channel is although we kind of keep the girth of the sleeve intact, the channel allows for a little more cooling below the head gasket and the head's going to run cooler, the gasket's going to run cooler and you're going to get some better sealing. That's why we cut this channel into the deck. For the open deck, on the other hand, you could also see plenty of girth on these sleeves. That's about a quarter inch thick right there. What we're doing is we're eliminating the stock aluminum, we're removing the stock sleeve, and we're giving you a, uh, a sleeve that could also handle plenty of turbo. Uh, you could handle plenty of nitrous as well. And this open deck version, frankly, even if you want to drag race it, you're going to be able to get to about 1,400 horsepower on a motor like this with that type of sleeve. Upwards of 62 pounds of boost if you wanted to really go that hard. I wanted to show you one of the inherent weaknesses that we found in this design, this Volvo block. You could see part of the stock sleeve. We left it in place on this demo block. If you look down in this area right here, the aluminum is infused into the stock sleeve. The stock sleeve has a serration or a threaded design on the outside of it. It's put down into a mold and the aluminum is cast around the stock sleeve. When you see these ridges down here, that's the aluminum breaking through. The downside to a motor like that or to a design like that under performance is if you really put a lot of boost in the motor, this area here that shows the aluminum breaking through, that can crack. And that's part of the reason we come up with a hardened sleeve, a, a, a thicker sleeve, so that it, it, you can throw as much boost in it as you want. Again, perfect for the street, no issue. Drag racing, not an issue. And far stronger than any stock block would ever be. On motors for the street, we're always going to recommend this open deck design, and here's why. You have all this cooling around the sleeves, similar to the stock block. The sleeve is directly cooled by the water jacket. It's the, wa the coolant is directly up against the sleeve, allowing the heat to transfer at a normal rate. Again, not a problem for drag racing, and for street, street performance, really not an issue. But for a daily driver on a motor that's going to want 
performance on the weekend, this is a design that's going to give you the, the cooling that you need if you're stuck in traffic uh, or if you're, you know, for instance, out in the desert or on a hot summer day, that type of thing. The closed deck design, again, okay for the street, okay, okay for, for um, daily commuting, but because there's more girth to the sleeve, the downside is it's going to run a little hotter. So for drag racing, we're going to recommend the closed deck or for heavy boosted motors, the closed deck. For the street performance, we're going to go open deck and, um, you know, it'll give you exactly what you need for the type of performance you're looking for.